Hey, what is up YouTube? So today we got our hands on the OnePlus 8 with the 5G version. Um, it has the old Snapdragon 865 with the 5G um, capable. And it's got five, a 6.55 Full HD Plus AMOLED display. And it's got 48 megapixel uh, rear camera with a triple camera setup. Uh, 4300 milliamp battery and it's got the 30 watt charging warp charging uh, charger it's got 128 gigabyte 6 gigabyte RAM and it's got the oxygen OS Android 10 which I know that they're gonna have Android 11 and 12 supported onto this this device so opening up the device here it's got a really sleek design the box is really big um, comparing to an S21 case. So just in comparison, you know, this is a almost, you know, two times the size of a case. So this is the pamphlet that uh, OnePlus has. So it's got the SIM card included since there's the T-Mobile variant and the brochure. And the SIM card slot trust. So I guess the reason why this case is so big is to fit the warp charger, which is right here. It's a basically a power brick, you know, that can charge your phone from you know zero to thirty in like fifteen minutes or so. So this is definitely you know a lot faster than your normal charger. And going on with the case with the phone. So this is the wire. It's got the OnePlus super fast charging wire. It's got the um, USB type C. And the rest of the phone, you know, it is a lot of just desk space. So this is all empty here. Um, so I guess from a packaging standpoint, you know, they really, you know, didn't try to save space, but um going to unwrap this phone so this phone is slightly bigger than the s21 so it definitely does feel you know slightly bigger than the s21 um the back i got the interstellar glow so it actually you know has a as you see in other youtube videos it's basically a bunch of uh different colors when you try to tilt the uh, different angles so it's got the oneplus logo very cool looking so let's power it on oneplus powered by android so this device is expected you know for any oneplus device is pretty snappy um, so this does have a slight curve edge to it almost like a samsung s10 and also the chin is a bit taller and the top as well than most 2021 flagship but you know for this price um, i got this phone there in black friday so um, for the price that um, i pay for i think this definitely is worth the price and worth the deal so and oneplus oxygen os is definitely better than your one UI Samsung, in my opinion, just because of all the bloatware that Samsung puts in to their phone, which um, sometimes can cause a lot of delays when browsing between apps. So, um, but in this case, I'm just going to do a quick setup. As you can tell, you know, this phone is fairly snappy um, to a lot of the um, your commands. So, so here's the home page of your device. Um, as you can see here, is the OnePlus 8 5G. So when I check for updates, so they do have Android 11. Um, so that's the first thing that I was looking for. Um, so this, you can install the newest um, Android 11 to this device. Um, I'm sure Android 12 will be coming up. But for this, 
cam um, I'm just gonna do a quick demo of their camera um, so this is definitely you know your one of your flagship two previous years flagship um, with all their features like time elapse um, it's got wide angle mode too for the time elapse the panorama slow motion uh, video you know if you record your video you can pause the video so these are all you know features as you can expect on a flagship phone um, when you're comparing to a lower budget phone you're missing some of these options right the wide angle um, but this is you know wide angle is pretty standard now in even lower budget phones but you know if, if you're going through all these settings um, pro mode um, so you know these are all you know features that you should expect in in smartphones so if you do a quick snap photo here um, the, so the snapping photo is fairly quick um, and you can check the resolution here um, so this was kind of blurred it did not capture the um, the focus maybe because I did too quick but the first one you know did um, provide some good pictures uh, so I'll do more further tests between this um, OnePlus phone uh, versus the Samsung um, S21. So stay tuned for more videos between you know this older version, last year's flagship OnePlus 8 with the S21. I'll take some samples, photos, and videos, and I'll post it on this uh, channel in the upcoming weeks. So please hit a like and subscribe to this channel if you enjoy watching this video and uh, stay tuned for more uh, comparison videos between my S21 versus this OnePlus 8. Let, comment below if you have any questions regarding to this phone and have a good day.